Prince Harry delighted a four-year-old girl when he gave her a hug during a walkabout in Birkenhead on Monday. The Duke of Sussex, 34, embraced Eliza Morris after seeing her sign Gingers Unite, I love you Harry among the crowds this morning. The prince approached the youngster, who also has red hair, and said I love this. Do you love your hair? The sign is amazing. Harry stopped as he and his pregnant wife, Meghan, spent more than 45 minutes chatting to the crowds in Hamilton Square, Birkenhead. Among them was Vanina Cochiu, originally from Brazil, who has travelled across the UK to see members of the royal family. She squealed with excitement as she got to compliment Meghan on her £1,085 red cent dollar coat. The couple began their visit at Hamilton Square to view a new sculpture erected in November to mark the 100th anniversary of Wilfred Owen's death. The statue, which is named after one of the Birkenhead War poet's poems, Futility, is cast in bronze and represents an exhausted World War I solider. They will unveil a plaque to mark the visit, before meeting local veterans and members of the Birkenhead Institute Old Boys, of which poet Wilfred Owen belonged to, and which played a part in the creation of the tribute. This afternoon they are set to visit tomorrow's Women Wirral, an organization that supports women in vulnerable circumstances. Initially established in 2011 to support women upon their release from prison, Tomorrow's Women Wirral has since expanded and now offers an extensive range of training courses and workshops for more than 6,000 local women. These include support groups around mental health issues, domestic abuse, and addiction. Harry and Meghan will hear directly from the women about their experiences, before visiting the on-site charity shop, cafe, and inspiration hall. They will wrap up their Merseyside tour with a visit to the Hive Wirral Youth Zone. Created by the charity on Sign Youth Zones, which is developing 21st century youth facilities across the UK, the Hive provides a safe environment where young people can come and enjoy themselves, building key skills and raising their aspirations and confidence. The royal couple will meet young members as they take part in a number of activities and workshops throughout the centre, before unveiling a plaque to mark the visit. Pregnant Meghan, who is expecting her first child with Harry this spring, is continuing to keep a busy schedule packed with royal engagements. The mother-to-be has already stepped out once in London last week and the couple will also make an appearance on Wednesday to watch Cirque du Soleil's totem at the Royal Albert Hall, as part of a fundraising campaign for Harry's charity sent to ball.